All right, let's get started. This here is Robinson, home to a Hershey's plant. Has such a little bit of a chocolate theme going on around here. As for the downtown area, well, not so bad. Not quite Effingham tier, but probably one of the better places they've been during this whole sojourn so far. I'm actually going to do something slightly different this time. I'm going to start far away from home and then move my, work my way back. So hopefully after hitting Robinson, I'll hit Oblong, then uh, Newton, which isn't technically new territory, but whatever. And I'll call it a day. Kind of, kind of be a uh, a short day. I did, let's just say, some volunteer landscaping work, which ate up a couple of hours of my time. So I'm not going to have all day today. Make three great throws. Well, if you insist. The new Hollywood. I'm not entirely sure where they get there. There's Goodwill back there. There's the post office. A realty place. I'm guessing it's just a bar of some description. Oh, dang, this, this is Trico. Oh, good thing it wasn't three great throws in a row. Courthouse Annex. Do or die. <laughs> Hair place. M&M sales. Resale shop. Turn around consignment. They already have a Goodwill over there. And an attorney's place. There's some sort of eateries over there. Interesting. But I'm not really interested in eating while I'm here today. Jenny's Oblong Iron. Nice little Memorial Day stuff they got going here. Crawford County Courthouse. Freaking Omanite ran on me. Oh, whatever. We're totally going sour grapes here, y'all. Crawford County Computers, Blades, Salon and Daycare, Antiques on Square, Chamber of Commerce. Big Daddies. All right, the square proper doesn't have many stops on it, but the area looks like to the east and just, yeah, east, southeast, pretty populous. Catch 10. Well, okay, if you insist. We're going to go up, get that one, come back down to those other two. Now, nah, why don't we just go south? Just wait right the heck into it. Yeah, that's what I think we're going to do. But there's no real raids going on over here except that Aerodactyl. And he's way off in the distance. <laughs> yeah, this is a thing. Right at the end of May, they still got Santa's shop set up over here. Yeah, nothing there right now. And in fairness, that is a stop. I'm gonna go a little bit up north. Hope the popo -po over there on my right side doesn't take too much interest. Uh, 
construction is that? That's north. Let's go west. Huh. That's actually their FBC. Interesting. Oh man, I gotta go to the actual police station. Well, good thing I'm pretty sure there's no warrants out for my arrest. I'm guessing that's the old Heath building. I primarily started recording because I found it interesting that all the way out here, we just suddenly have a stop and two gyms and I'm kind of, kind of curious as to what they are. Granted, I could have tapped on them and seen what it was, just based on the names, but I like to be surprised. Wow, a 91% EV. High base starting level too. That's a keeper. Might turn that into a second string leafy on or something. Oh, I need to get a perfect one specifically for Sylveon when 6th gen drops. That would be fan freaking tastic. Alright, now that we are within eyesight, Pride Corner, followed by the Veterans of Foreign Wars. I'm guessing that's a memorial of some sort. Followed by. Veterans Wall Memorial. Bitchin'. Oh, we like this place. Hey, it's a Hux. Over here. Oh, I remember this place actually has friggin' Big Red on tap. That's not something you see every day. It's been a while since I've been through here, but not that long. In fact, now that I think about it, there should be a coffee shop to the left of here, a couple blocks. Last time I remember, I think they actually were advertising that they were pogo friendly. All right, let's see if we can get across the street without dying. Didn't notice that it turned. There we go. Now we're gonna go across this one. Let's not get similarly distracted this time. Oh, we're good to go. BFW post, cool. Just opened up a slot for this research. Catch three poison types. Well, that's not going to happen anytime soon now, is it? Let's go up to the memorial, see it for ourselves. Oi. Yeah, Kabuto being a little bitch. Highly doubt he's worth it, but you never know. Did get that Eevee earlier. Alright, 
Let's head back, see if we can't find that coffee shop. Hey, you know what? If they're at, still advertising the Pogo Friendly, I'm gonna stop in there and get something to drink. I'm hoping my memory is off because I remember that coffee place was right next to the American Legion, which is why it was considered a stop, which is why they were doing the whole uh, Pogo thing. So, hopefully it's on the other side and my memory is just off. Uh, I'm hatching some eggs right now, getting rid of some research. Wait. Mimi's. Okay, I was wrong. It's on the other side. Ah, I don't see any Pogo advertisement. Oh no, that sucks. And a corkfish. One thing I really hate to see, it's a nice house going to waste. Someone's mowing the lawn, the house itself. Eh, it's kind of falling to pieces. And that one right there, that's actually a bed and breakfast apparently. Looks fairly nice though. I came out here looking for two stops. It looks like I found the Crawford County Historical Museum. And just down the road is the Poplar Street Victorian Gazebo. And I can see the beginnings of a park. One gym and one stop. Uh, that's a little out of my walking range though. I'm gonna have to head back. I might drive over to it later. research spin six stops you haven't visited before well that's gonna take a while and that's not an adventure week one that's just a regular one we're gonna see just how big that park is hopefully I think it's just the one gym and the one stop hardly seems worth it to be honest old days shooting irons Ah, they're closed. Shame. It's my kind of store. Let's see, after we hit that, what would be the most efficient route to hit those others? Try to go a couple of blocks that way. All right. Oh yeah, geez. From here, it looks like it's, looks like that park is just the one gym and the one stop. What a shame. There's the gazebo, for what it's worth. Research off that is spin two stops you haven't been to before. Cool. Looks like there's just a series of small apartments around here. What's this building? Robinson Palestine Water. Um, oh yeah, Palestine's a town not too far from here on the Hindi border. That would explain it. All right, signing off for a bit. This real quick, right down the street from the police station. That is a fairly decent faux gold statue of Jesus. Also, Bunky 60. <laughs> ah, okay. Get out of the car. I'm already being attacked by yellow jackets. Anyway, I decided to come to this park because from a distance I managed to see just barely a second gym take form. You can kind of see the outlay here. Turns out there is a second stop. It's one I haven't been to before, so yeah, worth it to spin it. Hopefully get some decent research off of it because this one just gave me a, what was it? Make three great throws. 
Yeah, not exactly a, a ringing endorsement. There's a Clee Ferry over there of all things though. This appears to be, a, I'm guessing, public pool. Playground right there. I'm seeing ball diamonds to the right, a little gazebo. Kind of the same situation they had in, uh, shoot, where was it, Martin? Was it Martinsville or Marshall? I can't remember. Or heck, no, it was, uh, it was Casey where they had that nice park and no stops to go in it. Wait a minute. I remember that. It's the Robinson Rotary Club. That used to just be a stop. Apparently it is now a full-fledged gym. Oh, someone's got a shiny Absol. P.R. Heather C. Nice. Whoa, there's another cl Hey! This place is a Clee Fairy nest. That's what it is. Tell everyone in the chat. Yeah, there wouldn't be nearly as many clean fairies here if it was just, I mean, if it was just cloudy. So, hey, that's another nest to take into account. Ah. They all disappeared because I got in the chat. Walk a little closer. I'm so glad they updated the OSM or whatever. Gave everyone proper... Gave everyone proper nests for a change. Newton's got a friggin' nest. I'm not sure if Robinson had a nest to begin with, but it does now. Not that I ever think I'm going to use the Clee Fable. But I like having the option available. You know, I'll probably use the restrooms while I'm out here. Yeah, that one's terrible. And the research off of the Lions International Pavilion is earn three candies walking with your buddy. Cool. Got an excellent on that Clee Ferry. Yeah, CP69 Clee Ferry. Hardly worth it. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely a Clee Ferry nest. There's two more of them right on top of me. And an Aeron over there. All right. I figure you guys don't need to see me take a leak. This will probably be my last transmission from Robinson. <laughs> 